These three delicious snack swaps are gonna lower your sugar intake and increase your protein, fat, and fiber intake, supporting blood sugar balance, plus they're delicious. I have strawberries and cream protein balls, black bean loaded brownies, and a cheesy kale chip. Hold the cheese. All right, let's make these strawberries and cream protein balls. First and foremost, you need a half a cup of hot water into your food processor. Then we're gonna work our way through protein, fat, fiber. First is protein. I'm using a scoop of grass-fed vanilla whey protein. It's gonna offer up 19 grams of protein. Next, we're adding a cup and a half of almonds, a half a cup of dehydrated strawberries, a half a cup of medulla dates. These are pitted. And because of the warm water, it's also gonna help incorporate the dates, soften them, break them down with the nuts. Then you're gonna add a fourth a cup of flax meal. This is gonna add fiber and omegas. And last but not least, we have a half a cup of shredded coconut. You wanna use half of your half a cup or a fourth a cup into your blender or your food processor, and then you're gonna save the other half to roll your balls. All we have to do is blend it up, create balls, roll them in the coconut, and we're good to go. You wanna make sure that all your ingredients are incorporating and creating a nut butter consistency. So about halfway through, scrape the sides of your food processor and start it up again. Should take about two to five minutes to create the consistency you're looking for. We're good to go. Now using a small ice cream scoop, I am just going to scoop out about two tablespoons, plop it in my hand, roll it into a ball, and then mix it in shredded coconut or a blend of shredded coconut and a little bit of those dehydrated strawberries to give it color. For the best results, put these in your refrigerator and they'll store for up to a week. And there we have it. A strawberries and cream protein ball that doesn't have any added sugar is sweet and delicious, sweetened with a little bit of date and loaded with protein from flax, almonds, and grass-fed whey. Baked goods are known for spiking your blood sugar, and that's because of the refined sugars and flours that are present in most baked goods. A great swap for refined flours is to add whole foods like beans. These brownies are made with black beans, which increases the protein, fat, and fiber of this brownie and it doesn't taste like black beans. They're chocolatey, gooey goodness that your kids and your family will all love, but without a major spike and crash. Plus, we sweeten them with maple syrup instead of refined sugars and add cocoa powder to give it that chocolatey flavor. When you're using coconut flour or an almond flour, these are innately lower in carbohydrates, higher in protein, fat, and fiber, and again, gonna support a blood sugar balanced curve. So if you're looking for a healthier baked good, swap out your refined flours for whole foods like black beans or white beans, and opt for a lower glycemic flour, like coconut flour or almond flour. 